Hi, everybody. My name is Melissa Stockwell, Dare to Try co-founder, along with Carrie Sirota and Dan Tun. And back in 2011, Carrie, Dan, and I met and decided that there was a need for an organization such as Dare to Try to get people with physical disabilities into the sport of triathlon. 15 years ago, I lost my left leg while serving our military over in Iraq. After I went through my rehabilitation, learned how to walk again, I knew I wouldn't be myself again until I got back into sports. And I'm proud to say that sports played a huge part in my recovery. Being able to get back in the swimming pool, to get on a bike, to put on a running prosthetic and feel the wind in my face, it gave me self-confidence, self-worth, and just the belief that I could do anything. So having that firsthand experience, Carrie and Dan, who have been in adaptive athletics their entire life, we developed Dare to Try. And having a modest goal the first year of getting 10 athletes, providing everything that they needed to get to their starting line of a triathlon, the training, the expensive adaptive equipment. And we not only got them to that starting line, but they swam, they biked, and they ran. They got to that finish line, and you could just see the self-confidence and the self-worth exuded in them as they were able to see how much ability was in their disability. Thinking back over the past 10 years, it's just incredible to think about all the people that we have served. We have served youth athletes. We have taken, you know, eight-year-olds who are missing their leg like I am, and we have gotten them to cross their very first finish line in a triathlon. And that only carries over to their self-confidence and their self-worth, but to their families as well. Being able to take injured adults, injured military members, and talk about making an impact, but having a newly injured military service member who shows up at our Dare to Try military camp is surrounded by dozens of other veterans who are also injured. And as a team, they swim, they bike, they run, and they complete their first triathlon, and they are forever a part of the Dare to Try family and seeing what they are all capable of. These times are unprecedented. We are living in a world that none of us ever expected. But right now, it is more important ever to give because those starting lines will be back. And when they're back, we want to make sure that we, can, we have the means to get our athletes to those starting lines, to swim, bike, and run, to realize how much they are capable of. Not only that, we want to be able to provide these, this expensive adaptive equipment, whether it's a hand cycle, a racing chair, or running leg to somebody who can still be active in their home, and they can remain active, and they can get out there with their friends, with their family, regardless of what the world situation is. The money that you donate will go directly towards helping an athlete with a physical disability see what they are capable of. The need is still there. So thank you for your donation. It'll go directly towards making an impact and you will be helping to continue our mission of inspiring many. Thank you. Donate now and build a stronger future for Dare to Try and its athletes. Thank you for supporting Day to Give.